I just wanna say, um, yeah. I just wanna say, uh, that I got a whole lot on my mind, yo. It's ugly out here, cuz hard to look at. Let me just put it to you like this, man. Yo, the jewels I spit reflect some elegance to the streets of the city. Cruel and connecting, he's testing his words, reek of a grizzly. Ain't no other way about it, man. Hoods of Philly, please, no pity. Hammers are banking from every angle, these cats leaving them empty. You wonder why all this violence? Damn, what the reasons is plenty. What our politicians are safe up in their offices, squeezing them pennies like in the streets. Cut my hair. I'm trying to make my hair. I'm trying to make my hair look like. I mean, you know, I don't want to look like I'm completely insane and shit. <laughs> Put my hoodie up and shit. Since you been here, hey. Put a hoodie on, you know what I mean? Nah, uh, I'm, I'm having a, yeah, I haven't had a cut kick. I was about to say, this guy, this guy gonna kill us. She acting on normal like I wasn't just about to bang her out. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, it's some normal shit. Yeah, um, yeah, he's okay to go yeah, that just, way. <laughs> she didn't even right. look at me. Like, mm, she's, she's, she's okay to go that way. She probably didn't think, she probably thought it was a way you could just go out. All right, so this is my man, Gene. He, he, uh... He's one of the oldest, one of my oldest homies, so he know all the breed stuff from back in the day. Yeah, I love how you just said oldest homies, like I'm old as shit. <laughs> he know all the stuff from back in the day when yeah. I first started doing this, when yeah. I used to drive around and yeah. force them to listen to my demos and stuff. Absolutely forced them. <laughs> shit, you were terrible in the beginning, man. Oh my God. Man. You were just young. It was like, it was with the young, the young rap. I was like, this guy. Really? He was like, yeah, it's his young Taj hitting him with the hitting with the e woo oo wee. I'm like, what? Taj G was my name back then. Taj G. A hyphen G. Taj. <laughs> then it was Sabotage. No, it was uh, no, so, Baby no, Taj. Baby Taj. Yeah. Which was like, I don't know why you thought that was going to be better. Man, I don't know. And then it was Sabotage. I should be going the other way. You should be going wherever you want to go. But it was like, you know. Yeah, no, it was Sabotage. It was a different time, man. It was a different time, man. It was like, but the music kept progressing. I still say your classic album. Definition. Definition, which I named, by the way. <laughs> I named it. Um, definition. Definition, man. That was still like, I, I still rock Definition. Yeah, you, and he want me to put it out. He want me to put out the my old album, The Definition. I'm I'm redoing it, and I'm renaming yeah. the new John Definition. Because cause it, it still has a classic feel. Even though, yeah, there's some things in there you're like, oh, man, yeah, I, I rap gotta, better than that. I progress. Stuff, yeah. But there's still, but there's still stuff in there that you you listen to and you can still play. It might sound facetious, but we better than most. <laughs> Breathe, man. You almost there, dog. Almost. You close. Ain't good enough. Nah. nah. You got a lot to learn. Yo. If you wanna hang. If you wanna hang. But for now, young buck. Guess what? Let Yo. the lady sing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's my mic on. Yeah. All in attendance. Please rise. I gotta clear this air, man. Shit. Never keep the barrel empty. Stroke the steel gently like a friendly woman. Stroke and feel entry. I only trust it if it's gutter. Crusty. Guaranteed must hit with the rusted musket locked inside the china cabinet. I keep shit dusty. One in my trunk's getting both. I bust nuts with. I try busted whips and try to look bump. Just trying to turn these chicks. Yo, they wild. Yo, they clumsy. Want me so. I brought girl all spray. Otherwise, I might be in your girl all day. You can't diss me. You need but it's like R&B without hip hop Two G's, G's, please me I put class in this game Y'all like Christina Spears more All y'all acts the same Gotta ask your name Your style don't be called Jack Cause you ain't coming right Like it's one ball in your sack Get your weight up Now I don't mean to sound facetious But we better than most we better than most You almost there, dog. Almost. You close It's got a little bit of work That's right, some of, almost stuff, dead, some of that stuff can still work though You close like, you're, you're right yeah. like, Some of that stuff can still work Um I mean, like, you gotta adjust the rap style a little bit, yeah. baby. But I mean, if you talking about putting out that, yeah, it, it could work for just like a precursor to. That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? And then also, man, it's like, look, man, a lot of these cats they putting out these '90s sounding albums and stuff like that. You got a, uh, you know, cats like I don't know, what did Defense Staples actually? Did? But it was like Joey Badass. Mm -hmm. He put out like a '90s sounding album. You know what I mean? Like. Most of these people, man, they still looking for that sound, man. Right, they still right, looking right. for that classicness because there was something about the '90s. And of course, that album was in the '90s. Uh, definition was, yeah, that was early 2000s. Uh, early 2000s, yeah. early 2000s. But yeah, you know, man, it still had a lot of. It still, it still feels relevant. Right. You know what I mean? And that's that's what's different about most of these cats nowadays, man. Most of these, most of the new stuff is not really relevant. Right. Like I'm not gonna listen to that later. Yep. Now people might say, "Oh, you old." You know, the new style is this. This is what we listen to now. 
I just don't see that stuff being that timeless. And maybe I'm some old dude, but well, the, I don't the, see it being thing, timeless. You're you right. It's not timeless. But the, the stuff that... I actually had to do that album. When I planned it, I had to write it and, and do the beats and stuff. Planning for it not to come out for years. So it's timeless on purpose. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Well, I, didn't, I, didn't th- I didn't know that. You never yeah, told me that. Like, all my stuff was done like that since I was younger. Like, I, that, well, not, maybe after I reached, like, 20. Like, the slang yeah. I used and everything had to be, like type of slang that I felt like would never phase out. Yeah. It's like a shame. You, like you didn't to, use, you didn't use like fresh. Right, right, right. Like, uh, what was it, was it word? Is word? Words out. Words, still, people still say that. Do they do? Yeah, they still I say mean, it a I little bit. Yeah. That's uh-huh. one of those old words you can still sound cool if you use it now, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. uh, like cool old dude type of thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but definitely not fresh. Yeah, not fresh. You can't use, yo man, that shit is so fresh. But, uh. I know, that don't work. So I had to, I had to, um. But see, the reason I don't want to put that out out though is because I want to redo some of the songs off of that. Yeah. Just revamp them, spit the same verses, mm-hmm. really, but like just. Well, that's why I feel like you can. I feel different. like you can tweet out the new Def. Right. And then later on, right, right, right. release the Rare Breed. Exactly. Classic. That's what I'm gonna do. You know what I mean? Because then I'm I mean, that was really under Rare Breed. It's right. not under right. the Wolf. Right. Although, you know I mean? like you were saying, like 75% of Rob's stuff is me. Exactly. Because <laughs> I used to always tell, like, well, you used to tell me, to, did you used to tell me to go sell, or was that man? Man was probably the one. Probably man me. telling you that. But I think I told you that at one point, too. I'm like, look, man, you can do it. Man absolutely is probably telling you to go. Right. To go. You know what I mean? But you don't, you, you think Dre is all right, though, right? I thought Dre yeah. was all right. Yeah. I thought Dre had some corny ass lines, though. <laughs> well, Dre himself thinks he had corny I mean, ass lines. I mean, so. he, what did he say? What did he say, man? Something about a banister? <laughs> or or show oh, yeah, the banister line. What was that banister line again? I can't remember. I'm trying to remember, remember that. It. I tried to find it the other day. This infamous banister line. Because it was like, yo, it's something like a banister. And I was like, what? <laughs> like, what the fuck was that? Or, um, or yo, yo, man, it's like I try to confuse him like Chinese math. You want it done like teams in March Madness. What? Talk trash now, you really gonna know what mad is. You know what bad is, I can tell by your rhymes. You know what ugly is, I can tell by your mind. I'm nothing different. I'm the same cat, simple and plain. Yeah, I know you're breathing now, but that's simple to change. Sorry, cats only worth about a nickel and change. You talk shit, but all you really do is sit and complain. I confuse the game like Chinese man. I like the fuse for the cats that can't find a pad. Cause I spit cats and dogs and bats and law. So take your team and go back to the drawing board. How you have no clue what you got to with. Or yeah. or sharp like a sharp, sharp like, like a tick tack, 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 tack. Tack. like a phone tag yeah. <laughs> like a phone tag I was like come on man but it, but and, but what I always loved about Dre is that he still sounded which was his name authentic, authentic. yep because yep. he cared about what he was writing even if he thought it might have been corny you always in that one uh, dude who you like but he actually Dre has a hip hop voice yeah he got a good voice but he's, he's got a good voice. He got a good voice for the hip hop voice. And him. Dre, Dre was like, and he knows, he knows that he wrote a lot of corny stuff. Yeah. And I used to tell Dre, stop trying so hard when you rhyme. <laughs> so be, he's right. like, these metaphors gonna kill him. Yeah. Like, it's not gonna kill yeah. him. And when, and when he didn't black. try hard, he wrote his best stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Man, I think I'm trying to think which was my best. Like the, for me. Oh, um, yeah, um what would you, you, you do? Huh? Oh, that was your favorite joke? I think I'm talking about what Dre oh, actually Dre, rhymed. Uh, Stronger was good too. I like stronger. Yeah. Stronger, he, he he rhymed on stronger nights too. But I, I thought, what would you do? I thought was, I'm in a zone, man. I'm like, I was like, if it, it felt fun. Yeah. What would you do? It felt fun when he was coming in with it. But uh. Right, yo. So, what was your favorite song off of the definition? Uh, true. Man, true and um. Uh. What would you do? Was my shit too. Man. What would you do? What would you do? True. No, those, and, those um, things would have to be done over for sure. And uh, sweater. Oh my god, man. Yeah, man. That joint is dope, but it's like I can't. I know. You know but, what I'm saying? But it's dope. Yeah. Lost Sweater was dope, man. Yeah. La la la. 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 La la la.
brought me out that morning must have left it at the studio, sleeping my eyes on an all-star weekend. Otherwise, I wouldn't have cared. Took the 25 minute drive, knew what I wanted to wear, so whatever. It's kinda warm for a day in February, so enjoy the sunlight ties despite this unnecessary journey. In retrospect, though, with this misstep, Ernie was a red light. In a section of Broad Street, you cross light. No time to roll my window down. She looks back, gives me a split second smile and keeps going. I'm like, the shorty lucky I even tried to holler. Don't even know what made me do it, cause my game white collar. I keep it discreet, never spend at chicks on the streets, but something about the way we cross paths to find laws of math. Driving home, I'm thinking about a phrase some character said in a movie I saw the other day. The words flashed in my head. Can't recall the name of the movie, but that phrase stuck to me. Seize the moment. I'm about, to, about to do something truly out of my character. Something made me go around the block and see if I could catch it still walking. If so, would I stop? Yeah, I know that was the purpose, but was I really up to it? Not really. In fact, I saw it purposely hoping I blew it. Cause if I saw it, I'd feel like a punk if I didn't stop her. When behold, that she was caught slow in the watch. So I pulled to the curb, surprisingly secure Waved her over and even more surprised she came to my door I ain't even feel like myself, like I was being controlled And, and life's a candy, I mean, I, it's hard for me to really choose But I used to really play What Would You Do Because uh -huh. it had a great, like I really think you put a What, what Would You Do out now Right Because it's that good Yeah And uh, Stronger I'll, I'll was tight I'll probably adjust the rhymes for more relevant today issues You yeah. know what I'm saying Yeah But Like today, I think, like I would put What Would You Do and uh, lost sweater, life candy. Lost sweater is dope, man. Uh, it, it, it's, it I, I know, I know, you know it's, I know it's, it's, it's more of the time, right? But people wouldn't know, I guess. Yeah, you know man. I mean, because the thing is, it's like it was you at a certain time, which is what I think I, I liked about definition. It was that it was, it was about the time. Right. It was about relevant issues that was dealing with you guys, and y'all weren't talking about the same old shit. Right. You know what I mean? And at that time, like, Cass was really trying to do the same old shit at some point. The, the definition that you heard, did that have Haas and, like, Ross? Yeah, yeah, and stuff like yeah. Right. Haas, which, uh, what was that, uh, Meet Me? Was it Meet Me? We would never meet again. Again. meet again? Meet Again. Was that Haas or no, was that, uh, Haas, yeah. yeah. I, his rhymes on that, that's why I, w I think I was fine with um, it just being, it still felt... It still felt not. It felt '90s when Haas guy came on. Right. Yeah, but I fit in the same song. Yeah, you know, he came in there like he was rhyming, like he was Curtis Blow. What's up, Haas? I see too many niggas locked in mental cages. Woo! The only escape is their imagination. My right hand writes life, life which was passionate. weird but kind of cool. Was, uh, I had to. You know, I can't even tell you what I had to do to get Haas and stuff to sound right, man. I had to literally <laughs> chop his rhymes up and place them on beat and stuff on the thing. So and, yeah. and that's not like, cool. so, so what I told him to do was run. He was a spoken word artist. So yeah. I told him to rap like you was doing spoken word. Don't try to. Uh, and I knew he didn't, and knew he didn't want to do it that way. Right. But I mean, sometimes, man, that's I mean, that's not what his, his skill was. But for some reason, though. It still fit. Right. Like it still worked with the album. My right hand writes lifelike and passionate animation. My pen sees more black and white than a Dalmatian. More black and white than a dog's eyesight orientation. That means I write page after page with no hesitation. My lyrics drop bombs with time detonation. I come prepared for the occasion with rhymes like an unwanted personal invasion. I crash ciphers with no invitation. See me on some pop shit. I scream ride or die with exclamations. I thirst for real hip hop and I'm losing. My patience, niggas chasing bling and cheese like rat races. I challenge you niggas to mental creation. Let me hear you spit something without mentioning bodily mutilation. They can't hide, they just stupid, man. Come on. We may never meet again. We may never meet again, baby. But if we do, I'ma walk up on you. And I'ma give you one big fat kiss. You know why? I know how Snoop felt that day When he was slumped down in his seat And the judge asked did he have any comments to make Attempted murder is the case that they trying to get me Now that I think back, I was better off killing me These crackers try to roof me and give me a quarter of the life And I haven't even lived a quarter of my life Quite unfortunate, right? Wrong why? It's a million niggas in different hoods singing the same song. Last week I had two of my closest friends die. And it hurts to see them gone. It's fucked and that's up, why I felt it's... like that album is timeless. Because it, it no even when it was a little awkward, it worked. I don't know why. Because a lot of times you think, oh, this shit's going to be awkward. It shouldn't work. But the album itself works. Yeah, they, I mean, you're going to have a couple of filler songs on there. You're like, eh, it's all right. But... Most, most of that album, man, that album, I love that album. Yeah. 
I love it. Personally, days of groups is going, man. I know. <laughs> I know, man. I mean, I, know. I mean, you got one of the greatest. Still can't put out an album as uh-huh. Outkast. Yeah, I don't know why the groups got to be. I mean, it's still like you got slaughterhouses out there. They mm-hmm. do, um, but they can't sell. Right, they can't sell exactly. I don't know what that is. Oh, man, I just think the attention. The, a lot of, a lot, I feel like a lot of time. Well, you mean you got those Migos and stuff like that. Now, so there are some That's groups. A group? I thought that was a person. No, those three so dudes. I was a little Th- Three dudes, man. Uh, Quavo, Offset, and, and I forgot the other dude. The fact that I even know that just disappoints me. But you know, there are groups, but it's it's doesn't it's just not that many. And I feel a lot of these cats are about trying to get in there and just do them. Mm-hmm. And um, I mean, really, do you need that many? Do you need groups when uh, most of your stuff is no, really like call? Yeah. It's like. A lot of it's like call and response, yeah. but it's not even that good call right. and response. And these, and I guess these days they just collab, they do collabos instead yeah. of doing. They do a, t- t- a ton of features. Yeah, features. Like that's what they call yeah, it now. Like features, yeah. Not collab. They call they call all that stuff now features, guys. Yeah. And um. Drake Drake will be on a couple of the new new joints I put out. He, oh good. Got, oh wait a minute, he writing again? No, he not doing. He not rapping. He doing hooks. Oh, he's doing hooks. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I'm in the zone, man. <laughs> Yo, that's what I'm saying, yeah, my man. And hooks. He's doing all the hooks. Yeah. He's a hook. He's a good hook guy. He is a good hook guy. He he's, like he like a like a version of like Nate Dogg sort of. <laughs> nah, I'm not gonna go that far. <laughs> he, hey, Dre, singing all the hooks and stuff. Dre, love you, man. I'm not gonna go that far. I'm not gonna put you in the same same section. That's like that's like saying, man. He's like he's like Method Man. I'm like, no, nah. Dre's Dre. Dre Dre's good. He's really good with hooks. I give it to him. He's really good with hooks. Yeah. So I mean, you get is, I, okay. He's a Nick Dog light, right? And right, a, and right, a right, poor man's right, Nick Dog right. and a poor man's math. Right. Like you want to hear him on the hooks because he's got an interesting voice. Yeah, that's true. I'm fucking with you, Dre. <laughs> I mean, I can't wait, man. I mean, it's it's, it's about time. I mean, we've been telling you forever, man. You, you better turn it to Jay Electronica, cause oh my God, yeah, never 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 release a, a song for, for man, nothing. reasons. I mean. Keep having setbacks every time I be about to release something. Did you know? Did you know when that dude came? Ooh. When we had that studio, I had a studio in Northern Liberties. I don't even think you knew about that. You no, was just like, I don't know where you was. I was. But, <laughs> New York, that, LA. Yeah, a studio in Northern Liberties, and this dude came through to interview for a, a producer job with us because we was listening to phone book. So he came through and was like, uh, he's like, yo, um, he's like, yo, you, you part of a group called the Breed. <laughs> Because I think you heard some of our stuff. Oh, okay. Oh, like, there was at one point where y'all dropped Rare off of that. I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah. He's like, um, well, it might have been Rare Breed. Because I think he was talking about the Definition album. Okay. Actually. Right. He was like, I was like, yeah. I was like, why you ask? He's like, because, um, he's like, because I, some dude came in at my bar shop the other day. <laughs> I remember that. It was like, I got to do hot shit on the street. It was y'all album. <laughs> I was like, what? Yep. That's crazy, man. But yet, you guys didn't put that album out. Right, right. <laughs> which which is the most annoying shit ever. It's like dudes, they don't put an album out, but you got barbershop cats talking about, yo, I got the new hot shit. It's this shit. How the fuck they even get it in the first place? Yeah, I don't know, man. We, we I'm, I was going to do like, a, I was thinking of doing like a documentary type thing. See if I could get like everybody from when I first started doing this to be to when I just had to cut everybody off of a solo mm. and call it the best um, group that never made it. I, might as well. Yep. You might as well, man. I mean, cat man, it's a shame, man. I mean, I even got, I even got the album on my phone. <laughs> That's how crazy it is. That's how much the stuff was. Let me see, man. These, these people don't even know, man. These people don't even know, guys. Hold up. I don't say that corny shit. Man, I'm doing no <laughs> Ain't no corny shit, man. You just need to stop talking all that craziness, guys. Corny shit, man. Yeah, man. Like, hey, let me, let me, let me, let me see. What would I do if I knew I couldn't fail? I don't know, sometimes I just zone out, just think about this, cause it's like, I used to, you used to start hurting yourself going, and this one was a hard shit, cause you start wondering, why can't life be this easy, right. you got people in this position, I mean, this yeah. why can't you, you know, it's alright, I ain't gonna say it wasn't thorough, but, <laughs> I mean, come on, man, listen to that joke, cuz, <laughs> Shit. Run for president, lift taxes for low income inner city residents. Give blacks the reparations that they never truly had. Focus on fixing home before matters in Baghdad, man. I campaign to do away with student aid and make college free for students as long as they made the grade. Expose government secrets, the truth in the Middle East. Make the UN serve a purpose, influence world peace. I get the 
position of power With media conglomerates to buy some kind of quality policy and have them honor it with. The news would aim to educate, not entertain And entertainment would aim to put substance before the game Yeah, yeah that's what, what I do, do. What you know that you could not I can still use a lot you of insane rhymes. You can still rhymes. use that, man. Yeah, the insane rhymes, I just spit it a little different. Because, you know, like you asked me, I was like, because wait, waiting for you is really true. And right. then it was to be. That was my other joint. I like, I'm, I'm doing to be on the new album. Yeah, yeah I'm doing that. To be the, the, the joint behind my second heat. Second heat, I'm doing that too. Uh, Somebody lied. I'm not doing that at all. Yeah, you don't have to. That was more of like you and right. Dre on that right, one. Right. Uh, live life is cool. Blow sweater was a joint. Yeah. Um, and I just love the hook of the way to uh, ever meet again feels. Like you people love stuff, that joint. I never really felt it. Everybody likes that. Man, listen, listen to how it sounds. Oh, no, I, I was, I was we may never be. Uh, baby, so. Look, I'm gonna listen. You know what I'm saying? I got this letter. I'm gonna be. I mean, it just, it's just simple. Yeah. I'm kind of nervous just to spare with real Yeah, y'all are still going to turn into one of those groups that never, never made it, but you should have. Yeah. Too many niggas locked in mental cages. The only escape is their imagination. Yeah. It just feels. It has a good feel. Yeah. That's what happens, bro. It's like you get stuff like that. And sometimes you just don't. You don't listen to the, to the winds, guys. Like people kept trying yeah, to tell you. Try, you got I, I learned to get a gauge. To get a gauge from the, uh, listeners more than my own. Yeah, you can't look at you both. Yeah. I said, hey, you got some, got some good shit in there. Yeah. I shit on your, your ex. Plus they about to take the house too. I got one wish here, simple one that they can have dope. Put my parents old and crippled to give them a chance to enjoy life. But time rushing, I know my better chance to make your grip is out hustling. Ain't nobody gonna help me but myself, and I thank God for help, cause I can't thank them for nothing else.